committee, executive committee, uh, with an, which was, it, formerly it was more of a one-man game, and now it's an initiative to kind of remobilize and revitalize the young people of the UK Army community and the church. So I'm really excited actually to have the diverse and very proactive team which I'm currently working alongside. So just some introductions. We have um, Mia over there, so one of our singers for today, who's our events director. <laughs> uh, we have Lara over there, who's our PR director. Uh, we have Sipan, who's our vice president. Um, and we have Stefan, don't confuse the names, who is our archivist. Um, so we, we, we look forward to hosting many more youthful events, um, one of which is actually the Christmas carols, but a mix of carols is a very community mixed um, environment. So just to keep informed of events and join the network, please do feel free to also scan this QR code or kind of talk to us later. Um, if you want to join, kind of be aware of the future events um, and also follow Instagram um, ACYO London. Um, so our crucial aim is basically to hold exciting events that ensure that everyone, regardless of their background, can be engaged in the Armenian community. We welcome, uh, whether like half Armenians, like Lara and Sarah, we welcome anyone, part Armenian, course Armenian, even Armenians by choice, everyone is welcome. Um, so, and one of the uh, events that we host is the Christmas because we tend to celebrate every spiritual event alongside just gatherings, parties, social events. Um, so as the Armenian Church celebrates Christmas on actually the January the 6th, but we live in the UK uh, where the majority celebrates it on December the 25th, we just join our brothers and sisters in Christ uh, through celebrating this event with as much joy as we can. Our scripture, 
Then the rest of his brethren shall return to the people of Israel. And he shall stand and feed his flock in the strength of the Lord, in the majesty of the name of the Lord his God. And they shall dwell secure, for now he shall be great to the ends of the earth.
for the grace of God has appeared for the salvation of all men, training us to renounce irreligion and worldly passions, and to live sober, upright, and godly lives in this world, awaiting our blessed hope, the appearing of the glory of our great God and Saviour Jesus Christ, who gave himself for us to redeem us from all iniquity and to purify for himself a people of his own who are zealous for good deeds. Declare these things, exalt and reprove with all authority, let no one disregard you. Dead for one year after each reading. Thank you. Let us all say in unison now, Dead for one year. For peace in the whole world and the stability of the Universal Church of Christ, let us beseech the Lord. Dead for one year that we may pass the rest of this evening in the remaining ways of our lives in peace. Let us beseech the Lord. Amen. For active ministry and Christian fellowship among our people in the UK and Ireland, that they may receive Christ, witness his love, and live by his gospel. Let us beseech the Lord. Amen. For our church leaders, that they may lead us in the path of salvation. Let us beseech the Lord. Amen. For all our people in Armenia, Asta, and all over the world in diaspora, especially our Armenian community in the United Kingdom, so that God will strengthen our faith and grant us strength and prosperity, let us beseech the Lord. Amen. For people around the world who are in any kind of need through famine, war, or natural disaster, especially our brothers and sisters in the Middle East, that the Lord Almighty might make his ways known upon the earth and his saving power among all peoples and help enlighten their burden and bring peace for all. Let us beseech the Lord. For Christians around the world, that the Lord may strengthen their faith and deliver them from enemies, visible and invisible. Let us beseech the Lord. For our parents, grandparents, school parents, relatives and friends, that the Lord may bless them and be with them, giving them the courage to witness to his gospel and love. Let us beseech the Lord. For all those present and that all those who could not be with us this evening, that the Lord may protect them and grant them his peace, let us beseech the Lord. That the Lord may hear our prayers and supplications, let us beseech the Lord. That our compassionate God may have mercy upon us and forgive us for our sins, let us all say in reason. The third scripture. And in that region there were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone round them. And they were filled with fear. And the angel said to them, Be not afraid, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy which will come to all the people. For to you is born this day in the city of David, the Saviour, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign for you. You will find the babe wrapped in swaddling cloths and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was the angel of the multitude, the heavenly host, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among men with whom he is pleased. <laughs> delivered. And she gave birth to, his, to their first son, 
and wrapped him in the swaddling. Sur vast vat sur pievas or sur yevan ma vor ashkat servas en mer vor miames sur past vat sur pievas or sur yevan ma vor khachet servas en mer vor miames sur past vat sur yevas or sur yevan ma vor khachet servas en mer